What's pimping and what's popping, y'all? Thanks for tuning in. First and foremost, let's get into my skin. Like, yes, ma'am. Give it to them. I said, give it to them. Now, my skin looks too good, y'all. Stay tuned for my everyday makeup routine. So after applying my primer, I grabbed my Black Opal Stick Foundation in Suede Mocha with an SPF of 15. So protecting my skin and looking good. Come on. For me, it's definitely dewy finish over matte any day. And I found out that the step that really helps to bring out that glow from deep within is to drench my face in some rose water before I go ahead and blend it out. So there's this little trick of applying a concealer that's closer to your skin color blending it out and then going on top with a lighter concealer to bring out the brightness so that's the step that i'm doing right here yes look at that so right now i'm grabbing my fancy beauty matchsticks and i'm going into the shade suede and if I miss any products, don't worry, they'll be mentioned down below in the description box. All right, so in this step, first I'll take some powder and dry down the area of my brows. Then I take some got to be glued on a spoolie and shape my non-existent brows into place. After that, take a little bit more powder set that got to be glued and in all that time that I'm setting and drying and setting and powdering and all that good stuff my concealer would have dried down a little bit making it potent in color then I just blend that hole out flawlessly Guess who coming out to play, y'all? It's Laura. Hey, girl. <laughs> this girl goes on smooth and comes off airbrushed. One thing about me is that I used to never, ever, ever contour my nose. Like I was so scared of a harsh line going down my face, but I've been trying. Like look at, you know, I think that looks kind of nice. After blending out the concealer with my finger, I went ahead and set that off camera with some more powder and then sprayed my face into sand with some more rose water. And look at that. Beautiful.
I feel like gloss and some days I feel like matte. So now I'm about to show y'all one of my favorite lip combos for a black girl friendly nude lip. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and watching. If you watched all the way to the end, you're a real one. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Oh, 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 oh. Let me know what videos y'all want me to post next. I'm leaning towards maybe an oral hygiene video or maybe like a morning routine or something. I don't know. Let me know what y'all want to see from me next. And I will do my best to put that up for you guys. Yeah, thank you for tuning in. Love you so much. Mwah. Bye.